Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading. Will my ex come back? Uh, this is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. Uh, so these are the Leo individuals that are currently uh, entertaining the idea of reconciling with an ex or an ex wanting to reconcile with you or both of you guys are wanting reconciliation. Um, so we're going to take a look at um, you and your ex's current mutual energies and then uh, we'll see what happened between you guys that uh, caused the separation. And then we'll close out the read to see if there's going to be reconciliation between you two. Um, so uh, keep in mind to apply this to your own unique situation. Switch the roles if you want. Um, also, that uh, these are general messages. Just take what resonates. Leave the rest behind. Uh, if this message didn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. Um, what else? Uh, if you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up. Like this video so that this message can circulate around to the individuals that need to hear this. Share this video with someone if you feel like there's someone out there that you know that needs to hear this. And uh, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. For those of you guys that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. All right, so let's get started, Leo. Uh, what are the current mutual energies between Leo and their ex? Even though I'm asking about the mutual energies, it could be just one of you guys feeling this, uh, uh, this way, okay? So like I said, just apply this to your own unique situation. What are the current mutual energies between um, Leo and their ex? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sign for February 2022. We have the Two of Cups that jumped out here. Okay, so both of you guys are in love with each other. Um, current mutual energies between Leo and their ex. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, with the Queen of Wands in the reverse, and the Page of Swords. So, Queen of Wands typically is Aries energy for me, but it could be any of the fire energy energies. So, Leo, I feel like that's you. And then we have the King of Cups and the Fool. Aries, not Aries, Cancer, Pisces energy, and then Aries energy with that Fool. Also, it could be Aquarius here. And what are your current mutual energies? You know, I feel like you guys are moving very slowly right now. I don't so, you know, I feel like this 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 connection never really took off, I feel. I don't know, because I feel like right now, Leo, you're in this energy of not feeling interested or that you're not interested in this individual here. Okay? You could be spying on this individual, or this person could be spying on you. Uh, but um whoever this is, I mean this King of Cups could be in this energy of maybe scared to commit, scared to take a leap here with you. Um, let's see what else we have here. I do feel like there's mutual love between you guys, though. Uh, two of Cups. We have the Six of Cups here. Look at that. You guys have... With the Six of Cups, I feel like you guys have had a past uh, life together here. Uh, the Knight of Pentacles. You get the two of swords. So I feel like there is a bit of confusion here. Um, I don't, so someone here could be in this energy of trying to decide what to do, trying to uh, figure out which way to go, uh, trying to figure out if um, someone here should give this, uh, you know, a second chance or not. Uh, page of uh, Queen of Wands in the reverse. <clears throat> Queen of Swords here, you know, I feel like, yeah, it's so, it's strange because I feel like um, you have to be mean to this person in order to shake this person, uh, uh, in order for them to do the right thing. Um, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, tell me about the Page of Swords. Okay, we have the Ace of Pentacles here. So, Leo, you could be in this energy of pursuing new things here by yourself. Or that you could be in this energy of perhaps thinking about your ex here and wanting a new beginning with this ex here. Uh, so King of Cups, you could be dealing with a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have Temperance here. Sagittarius energy, you could be dealing with a Sag. You might have Sag in your chart. Uh, the Fool. 
and the sun. There you are right there, Leo. Interesting. You know, I feel like we have a king here that's trying to pursue their peace, trying to pursue their happiness here. You know, I feel like this person, you know, I feel like both of you guys might be dating around. You know, the thing is, I feel like, I don't know, I'm feeling like this queen was really mean to this king, okay? And I feel like this king couldn't handle it because this king was is very sensitive. And, and I just feel like this king is kind of off doing their own thing. I feel like both of you guys are off doing your own thing. So maybe both of you guys are having a hard time deciding whether to bring this back together here with the Three of Cups and uh, the Lovers here. Okay, there's this energy of taking a step back and not taking any action right now. If there is any action being taken, it's moving pretty slow here, especially with the uh, Knight of Pentacles being here, because that's a very, very, very slow energy. So Leo, you can take, uh, place yourself where you see fit, either you're this queen here or this king. Um, you know, I feel like this queen could be a bit aggressive with this king, and I feel like this king didn't really know how to handle that. Right now, this king is definitely in more of this peaceful energy, more happier energies, perhaps since the separation. But there, like I said, there is mutual love between you guys. Um, what happened between uh, Leo and their ex here that caused the separation? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for February 2022. What caused the separation between Leo and their ex? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for February. Um... 2022. One more. All right, let's see what we have here. you might have been dealing with someone here who's very 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 immature both of you guys could have been very immature here okay we have the page of wands aries leo sagittarius energy um nine of swords you know i feel like this page of wands is what is the same person as this queen here and this page of cups is the same person as this king so the page of cups and the chariot cancer scorpio pisces energy cancer energy with that uh, chariot. And then we have the Six of Pentacles and the Devil, Capricorn energy. So energies we have here, the ones that I just mentioned, we have Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, um, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. It could be any signs here. I mean, you just, yeah, you could be dealing with any of those signs. You might have any of those signs in your chart, but it seems like it was a toxic situation. You know, I feel like this king felt led on by this queen or something like that, okay? Felt breadcrumbed. I do feel like there's a bit of codependency here. I do feel like both of you guys might have inner child healing that you guys have to do that you guys never really uh, dealt with before. But I feel like it's a situation where things got really, really, really out of control, okay? Um, let's see. The Page of Wands. You have the Eight of Wands here. You know, I feel like someone here needed to be in constant communication all the time. I'm getting a very overbearing energy here. Someone here could have been very, very overbearing. Nine of, uh, nine of Swords. We have the Strength card, Leo energy. There you are right there. Lots of Leo energy here. You might have multiple Leo placements here. Uh, maybe a person uh, that you're dealing with have multiple Leo placements on uh, Page of Cups. We have the world. This person could have, uh, this person could be at a distance from you, by the way. We have the chariot in the world. So that could, be, could have been the factor here, maybe. The distance, we have the Knight of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini energy. Uh, I'm feeling like a one-sided energy where one person was traveling to uh, the other person all the time and the other person was not doing it. So I feel like there was a lack of equal give and take here with the Six of Pentacles. Um, Six of Pentacles. There's definitely a lot of keeping tabs on someone here uh, because I feel like someone here is texting and calling a lot, okay? The Devil and the Three of Cups, okay? And we have the Hierophant, Taurus energy. 
and then we have the Three of Cups here. Some of you could have a drinking problem here too. It feels like it's this King of Cups here. You know, I feel like there is definitely some sort of disappointment surrounding this connection because someone here is definitely looking for some sort of reconciliation. I feel like the person that's looking for the reconciliation is this queen, okay? Because this king is off sort of doing their own thing right now. This king could be in this energy of healing, going through some sort of awakening, some sort of spiritual awakening, okay? Um, and I feel like this king might be surrounding themselves with these individuals that are on the same path as, as this king, you know? Let's see. Yeah, we have the Two of Cups here again. You guys definitely have some uh, mutual love here towards each other. You know, I feel like this person couldn't... I feel like this person had a hard time controlling their anxiety, controlling their stress here. And I feel like this, I feel like this queen really took it out on this king. Because like I said, this king is a very, very sensitive individual here. And I feel like this queen could have been a bit aggressive, okay? Let's see what else we have here. Will there be reconciliation between Leo and their ex? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. Will there be reconciliation between Leo and your ex? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for February 2022. All right, Ace of Wands and a Ten of Cups. You know, we do have someone here that's still very passionate about this connection. And I feel like the individuals that that's really passionate about this connection is probably this queen here. We have the Empress here in the Four of Wands. Seems like it's this feminine energy that wants another chance here. But like I said, I feel like this king is kind of doing their own thing, trying to heal. Libra Taurus energy with that uh, Empress here. And then we have the Sun and the Strength card. More Leo energy. Lots of Leo energy here, by the way. You know, I feel like this King is seeking some sort of help here, okay, regarding their issues. Like I said, this person could have drinking problems, okay? Um, this person could have unhealthy attachments here. This person could be seeking some sort of help to move those negative energies that's lodged in this person's physiology here. Uh, Ten of Cups, uh, the Knight of Pentacles. This is a this is a slow moving thing. This is like a slow moving connection here. Whatever, whatever, whatever is going to happen here, it's going to take some time. Uh, Ace of Wands, <coughs> Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Lots of Earth energy here too. Tell me about this Empress. We have the Page of Wands here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. You see, um, you know, I feel like both of you guys have some inner child uh, healing that you guys need to do here. <coughs> four, <coughs> four of Wands. We have the Seven of Swords. There's definitely some lies and deception going on here. Whoever this feminine energy is, this, uh, this is a very mean individual, I feel. Okay, I feel like this person could throw like uh, like some hissy fits, temper tantrums here. Um, I feel like this person has a hard time regulating their emotions. The sun. And the six of pentacles again. Tell me about the strength card. And the King of Cups. You see, I feel like this King King of Cups is definitely trying to focus on themselves here. Trying to regain their self-worth, their strength here. Trying to find happiness uh, in um, something that they've been dealing with here for a very long time. I do feel like someone here is addressing their issues here. Will there be reconciliation? I don't think so. Yeah, we have someone here that's really off try doing their own thing right now. So, Leo, I hope this was helpful. I hope this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Uh, yeah, Leo, I feel like you're this king. So, I mean, you can place yourself where you see fit, okay? Um, yeah, so um, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you guys haven't done so yet, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys.